So a common question we get in local SEO is how to rank outside of the city where your business is located. So people want to rank outside of the city that their brick and mortar is in, but they have challenges ranking in the surrounding cities. And so we actually got a question from Louise in New York and she asks, is it possible to rank outside the city my business is located in? For example, my dry cleaning company is in New York City, but we service Manhattan, Brooklyn, and Queens, but can't seem to rank there. So this is a very common question that we get from uh, potential clients and a lot of SEOs get from their existing clients regarding local SEO. And we should mention that this does not pertain to local businesses with multiple locations. This pertains to when you have one brick and mortar, I should say one, not two, one brick and mortar, and you want to rank in a city beyond the city where your, your brick and mortar is located. So the first thing to understand is that Google is very focused on user experience. So I mentioned that because it means that when you are trying to rank outside your city and you have to understand that if somebody in Brooklyn is searching for a dry cleaner near me, quotation, or dry cleaner uh, in Brooklyn, Google does not want to present them with results in New York City because they're not going to want to drive there or they're not going to want to um, take a train there or whatnot. So um, they want to present searches that are local that pertain to a local business and that has to do with proximity. So that is a user experience factor that Google takes into account, which is why it is so hard to rank in a city that you're not in for a local business. But most of the time people, when they ask this question, their goal is to rank in Google's map pack. So they want to rank in the map for a city that they're not in to showcase that they service the, the, the search query. So if somebody's in, in Brooklyn and there's a great dry cleaner in New York City, um, they want to show up there. They'd want to show up for that search because they think they deserve it because they, you know, maybe they already have clients in that location. So there are some ways to do that um, and we can go over them now. So um, one strategy that tends to work the best is to shoot for organic listings rather than the map pack. So you can do this by creating unique service pages for all those places that you, all the cities that you want to rank in. So if you are that New York City dry cleaner and you service the surrounding cities, you would actually create a dry cleaning service Manhattan page, a dry cleaning service Brooklyn page, Queens page, so on and so forth for all the surrounding cities that you wanted to rank in. And so the second thing that you want to do along with this organic strategy is actually put a areas we service item in your top menu and then have a drop down or have that page list out all of the cities you service and actually link to those individual pages. And you want to link to those individual pages from other pages on your site to spread the authority and to increase, increase the rank, ranking potential of those other city searches as well. So um, when you do this, rather than maybe hide, hide that in the footer, you see a lot of sites that will hide the areas they serve in the footer to try to, 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 to rank like that or actually create those pages, but they don't actually you know, show it forward facing to consumers on their website. They put it in their site map only or they put it in their footer links. But what you really should do is put it in the areas you serve section right in your top menu um, and, and build internal links to it. Um, so that should really service that aspect of, of ranking organically. Um, it can still be challenging to outrank your competitors like that, but if you do all the other SEO stuff right and you have good domain authority, then you, have, you, you stand a strong chance of coming up in other searches that are outside your city. So the other thing you can do that's outside of organic SEO is of course do pay-per-click advertising using Google AdWords. Uh, we like to use ad extensions. These are a newer feature for our clients to try to rank outside the cities that they're in. So uh, hopefully that helped clear up some of the air on how to rank outside your city. Um, if you have any other questions, please send them in in the comments or email us through the site and please subscribe um, if you want more local SEO tips like this. And please like the video. Uh, thank you for your time. Have a great day.